welcome to our first stream of Pokemon Shield. My name is Phonix, and I'm here with two, yes, that's right, two different people. I've got CJ, and I've got Rocket. And as you can see, our name is... Uh, it's a colon... Wait, why is it like that? I thought we put a colon. Oh. It changed it. Forget it. We are... Uh, we are. Uh, Wait, it's a the... colon. It's right there. No, they changed... No. Well, I had semicolon, and it went with colon. No, we had instead. semicolon. <laughs> I forget. We have colon, question mark, period. That's how you're going to pronounce it. Colon, question mark, You're going to have to say period. each one in each sentence. All right. So this is CJ. That was CJ, and this is Rocket. In introduce yourself. Right? Speak. <laughs> Speak, my man. All right. And here we go. I dropped my phone, guys. Well, crap. We're not uh, forgiving him reach. for that. I got it. Uh. Oh, look at that stadium. Look at all those people. And they, they unironically use the unknowns as a language for other <laughs> <Yes. freedom> language. <laughs> Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. I'm not gonna read the whole thing. Our beloved Gallant region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. I totally forgot green eyes are a thing in our world. <laughs> as you know, our society is able to thrive. When was the last time you saw someone with green eyes? I technically have them. You have Hazel. Like Close a... enough. Thanks to help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us. In the sea, in the skies, and even with us in our towns. Sounds like a dying old man. I, I thought that's what we were going with. I don't know. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete. I thought he kind of sounded like Yeah, this guy got some big hands. I remember <laughs> Pokeballs taking up the entire hand. We call Pokemon trainers. <laughs> oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose, and it's a pleasure to be here. I love when he himself Rose with his old he's only wearing red shoes. Why does he have to introduce himself at this point? Isn't he like the mayor or something? He's like, <laughs> yeah, something like that. President. Okay, so so in case ever, nobody knows, I'm the only one who beat the game. I think CJ, you beat the game. I too? beat the game. That was so that was long. That's when it came out. He beat the game, and Rocket has not touched it. I beat it like two days after it came out. So so I, I'm the I, other one who kept up. I've seen funny, but I've not played. The so only thing I remember... Did you play in, Did you see any of the story, the actual story? Isn't that much of a story. The only thing I remember is your best, your your rival, your friend, his brother's like the champion of the entire region. Like, the reason um, why I'm asking is I want to know if you know who this guy actually is. We'll figure it out. Keep going down. Yeah, he's, like, he's like the president of energy or something. Perfect. All right. So now turn your gaze to the Gala region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for yep. Champion Leon's Expedition Match. Leon Pokemon sucked. <laughs> he did. Well, he had Charizard, so does that. But he has a Charizard. It's unbeatable. <laughs> yes. He, he is funny. All he needs is a water type. You'll beat him. Like, he know, Dude, he has, and he knows type matchups. Like, that's... That's, dude, that's like 100% Pokemon, I'm pretty sure, isn't according his, to this game. Isn't his Charizard the only one he can, he can Mega Evolve in this game, if I remember? Uh, no. There's a few of them. I don't oh, think no, he can Gigamax. Mega Evolve Charizard. Yeah, you can still Gigantamax. Yeah, Gigamax. But very few can Dynamax. I wasn't a, I wasn't a big fan of Dynamax. I think my favorite Pokemon thing is when they um, Mega Evolved them. Mega that was evolved. too. Oh, I love that so much. The very first game when they had that in there too it was easy to get to level 100. Bro, I remember, I remember um, Mega Evolved. Uh, what, what was his name again? It was it's the Fire Chicken. Oh, uh, Blaziken. Blaziken. Mega Evolved Blaziken got banned from the no, got banned from tournaments. Um, he was banned yes, from Torch, tournaments. Torch, that, Torch, Combustion, um, and Blaziken. Blaziken, Mega, Mega Blaziken, that's it. Blaziken. Yeah, he got banned from tournaments because of how powerful he was. Dude, no, yeah. Mega Evolution, I really like that. I think it was, um, because it was, it was cool, like, with having one Gigantamax meta-wise just makes things weird because of it. it has some bizarre properties. 
<laughs> yeah, I done it. We have colon question mark period question mark. Oh uh, yeah, look at that name. What's up? <laughs> oh, that's the best. <laughs> Wait. Oh, that's your flash. That's oh, your flash that's new your phone. Five, your flash new phone. Question mark. Period. Question mark. <laughs> that's probably the best thing right. I've seen today. <laughs> it, the name is extended. That's the whole she said, name. But he said, "Were you watching my brother's exhibition match?" No, I don't care about your brother. <laughs> Sorry, I thought we were gonna kind of do like we're just kind of chatting about Pokemon while this is going on in the background. Yeah, but I saw that and I had to point it out. As I'm doing it. Okay. Uh, so does anybody want to voice Hop? I love how his name is Hop. I feel like it's meant to be Hope, not Hop. But they just forgot the E. I feel like I feel like they just forgot the E. Not people can read it themselves. Okay. So, so yeah. So my favorite Pokemon was uh, was actually uh, Mega Evolved Metagross. Oh, I never said Blaziken was my favorite Pokemon. No, no, for for Mega form. Oh, Lucario is my favorite. That one was pretty common though. I really like the, especially the White Metagross. Oh my no, god. No, Mega Evolved Garnevoir. Ah, oh, Mega. I love. Garnivore. Yeah, yeah, Mega version. Garnevoir is my second favorite Pokemon in the entire series. Oh Whale yeah, Lord Mega Gardevoir is my first, Star Wars my, my best. Love that Pokemon. The very first oh, no. one. Do you know about the Mega Lock? I remember when you got a Whale Lord. And, hey, look, uh, we now have colon question mark period exclamation mark. Nice. I remember when Whale Lord was playing the game. You played Whale Lord. He was just so overpowered at the time. He still kind of is. Yeah, it kind of sucks now. They, they nerfed him big time, but it, because he has spurt, it's so busted. Because the more HP he loses, and he's an HP type, the more damage he does. You know what I love? Only two games ago, before this one. They nerf fly and dive because back in the old games you could just click fly, fly in the air. They miss you, keep hitting a boom. And that's they have thunder. Yeah. <laughs> they're like, oh god. Same for earth. Same for dig. You need earth. You need earthquake in order to hit him or magnitude. Come with me. I don't want to. <laughs> what was your favorite Pokemon Rocket? I think that they did um, the the villains in this game a lot better than the other. I really like the really sharp like Are you Rocket. What? Not Rocket. What? Rocket. What's your favorite Pokemon, my guy? I'm favorite Pokemon in general. Well, we'll go with Mega Evolve first, because we haven't Gardevoir. even said what our favorite. I did, I said Whale Lord. So Mega Evolve Gardevoir is your favorite? Oh, yeah, well, for Mega Evolve, yeah. Yeah. Um, it might be Lopony. Who? Lopony? Do you know the, oh, the Mega? Do you know the Mega Lopony? What you do? You give it um, Fake Out and then Last Resort and no other moves. And just oh, Lop really Bunny. I know what you're talking about now. Everyone pronounces it differently. <laughs> well, they call it Lop Bunny Seriously? with a P, but I, they should call it Lop Bunny with a B. Yeah, Lopunny. It's a P. I know. Look at little Eevee. Ooh, look at little Eevee in the background. You think we burn in fire, it'll become... I never even noticed a little Nintendo Switch in the game. You never noticed them? They're all over the place. Yeah. No, I never noticed a little Nintendo Switch. So, um... Game Pokemon games always have like the latest Nintendo console in your room. Oh, I didn't know that. That's cool. <laughs> it's a brand new telly. I, your mom bought it so that you could use it so that you could use your game console. She bought um, it specifically I really like for that. Yo, this girl know how to do that cable management, bro. There's no Wait, wires. Why would they use the television? The Switch doesn't need a TV. I know. That's what's so funny about it. We're using it on a monitor. <laughs> Oh my god, look at that Pikachu. Come on. Yo, how, how do you read that clock? <laughs> There's no handles. <laughs> There's no handles on the clock. <laughs> Dude, and three of it's it's two, one, one, or one. This Morse code. <laughs> dot dash, dot dash. I'm there are no cables coming from the Nintendo Switch to the TV. <laughs> oh, it's mum. Mum. Not mom. Mum. Mum. Mummy. Mum. 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 Look at this map. Look at this map. Nostalgic at this point. It's been over a year since we really played it. All right, let's go. God, I, I wish our world looked like this. No, our world looks like crap. Honestly, I think the pixel No, that, what do you mean hurt. with these... Got some uh, GameCube graphics here? <laughs> like, literally. <laughs> Look at all the luscious green there. I has. love how there's like Pokemon like all the way in the background. If you see in the top right corner there. Yeah. Oh, that's so sexy with like the yeah. Pokemon flying around like that. Love that. You think he sleeps on that sheep? 
<laughs> he probably does. Because at, at one point, um, it, I think there was fan art of him and he is lying with the sheep next to him. I'm not gonna lie, there's no point for those steps. Yeah. Here's the real question. If, Sorry, Wulu, the if you sh shave a Wulu, will it be a big ball with small fur or would it be like a wiener dog with really big fur? I feel like it'll be a wiener dog with really big fur. <laughs> Possibly. Because it has an ability, right, where it's the coat. I don't remember. Because, like, that, sheep are, like, really skinny. Their fur is just really big. So, hey. by that logic, a Wulu <laughs> you think is actually you, a skinny... You think, you think if you break the rock around Gollum, will he be a skinny... skinny thing? Doesn't that happen when he uses Explode in, like, Pokemon Coliseum? It's probably big dude. Big man. He's Ooh. a chonker. <laughs> He's chonking it. I, I remember... Oh god, I remember when you, you always caught a golem and you always came with self destruct and the self destruct was just bad. It's a bad move. Dude, wait, you can't bad. catch golem. No, I mean, <laughs> yeah, when you, you get it, it gives you self destruct. <laughs> like, when you when you get a golem that's like evolved, it's the first thing it says you want to teach your golem self destruct. Yeah, pretty much. They should call it frag grenade. <laughs> you got a bunch of rocks around and we explode. Go, go frag grenade. Go. Use explosion. Maybe that was idea. <laughs> it might just be. Okay, so now I have a question for you guys. What was your favorite Pokemon when you were a kid? Now this is like before, like Gen Four. Like we're talking Gen One, Two, and Three. Non-legendary or legendary. Either. All right. Uh, what's Probably Gen 4 again? That's a uh, Palkia Dialga, right? Oh, you know what? Let's, let's do it by this. We'll go Gen by generation. 4, Gen 4 is Palkia and Dialga. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, um, let's go by generation. We'll go from the first generation up. So, in the first generation, my favorite Pokemon was actually Rhydon. I fell in love with that, but it was so hard to get. I don't know. I was a, I was a Venusaur at the time. What about hmm. you, Rocket? <sighs> First 151 Cause, Pokemon. Cause I know, I know, I'm not odd guy. I know everyone in the, in every game gets a fire or a water. I can't type. remember what I like. I just get the grass one back then. Yeah, cause nobody uses it, so it's good to use. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so you don't remember the first 150 Pokemon? What was the song again? No, 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 no I don't remember which one was my favorite back then. <laughs> I don't remember it by heart. Uh, well, what about now? Like, out of 150? Hmm. Gyarados is pretty... A shiny Gyarados is pretty sick. Yeah. Gyarados was pretty awesome. Though, most people didn't realize how to get Gyarados when you first played the game until much later on in the game, and you're like, oh. <laughs> nah, that too, my first game was back in Gen 2. I ain't, I ain't that old. <laughs> Okay, well, you start us off. What was your favorite Pokemon in Gen 2? Um, well, it was for, um, um, for Alligator. Um, it's pretty respectable. I kind of forgot Gen 2 a little bit. Hold on. They just added 100 Pokemon. Mine was Tyranitar. It's been Tyranitar ever since. I'm pulling it up now, but I don't, I don't remember Gen 2 that well. And I didn't know that Tyranitar was in the game until Gen 3, so. Um... But yeah, I would agree with you. When I was a kid, though, Froligator was my favorite. Yeah, it's, when I was a kid, Froligator now, it might... Yeah, I actually would have to be Tyranitar, because I, I totally forgot Tyranitar was Gen 2. Yeah, oh my god. Yeah, every time I build a team, like a competitive team, I always have a Tyranitar. Yeah, no, Umbreon was my favorite in Gen 2. Oh yeah, Umbreon was really good. Oh my god, it's this guy again. <laughs> Go away! I don't care. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> I got four, hey, I got you can't four use ellipses after our names. That doesn't work. Only remember. <laughs> <laughs> Only remember. <laughs> no, it's even better. <laughs> Why would Pokemon come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass? Not really. Are we moving on to Gen 3 now? Oops. All right, yeah, so let's move on to Gen 3. Um... God, I forget. You're I starting off. You could probably just mash the text if I we're not actually Gen reading it. Or go a bit best. faster. Uh, I'm trying to give people who aren't as fast at reading a chance, because, you know, my siblings are not very good at reading. Due to, uh, you know, impaired vision. Uh, 
I figure we we're just trying to hurry quickly hurry to um Yeah, so um new content. Gen 3, Gen 3 Guarnivore. Guardivore for Guardivore. you, Gen 3. When I first went through there, my favorite Pokemon was Swamper. Oh my god. Swamper. He, I mean he looks just like Shrek, man. Like he looks like a big old Shrek. I, as would tend to be the case, Starter was probably favorite grow, um, with um, Sceptile, but then I also um, also Gardevoir because that was my other big Pokemon I used. Yeah, I I just oh, and then my favorite legendary from that was Shaman. Oh, my favorite legendary is Rayquaza. Oh, but Shaman was Gen Four yeah, too. Now you know we're about to move into Gen Four now then. Yeah, well, there you go. Gen 4 favorite, My Shaman. favorite Gen 4 is Dialga. Really? I love Dialga. We're up to two legendaries now. What about you, Gen 4? Rocket? Oh, God. Gen 4. Yeah, I'm thinking. I know my starter was Infernape, but... I think Empoleon was cooler, but I'm trying to think, um, I'm trying to remember what other Oh, Staraptor. Yes, oh, that one oh, was such was cool. a good well, design. My favorite legendary is Dialga. If I had to say my favorite um, Pokemon, what was the name again? Tor, uh, the turtle, the Tora. Uh, Torterra? Torterra, Torterra. Cause I was playing when I used to play it, I, I chose him. Yeah. And I always played with him, and it was, it was really strong. And I was like, hmm, what if I had a Torterra? You could just lay on his back and you know ride it all around. He got a tree on it. It got some shade. Yeah, actually, it was really silly what they did. Is I believe it was Empoleon ends up getting weak to uh, all all the the final forms of Gen Four starters. Um, no, no. Gr um, as I water resists ground, I think. Yeah. But it doesn't resist grass. Yes, but uh, no. So grass, but the uh, the steel resists. The steel actually resists the grass. Yeah, but oh no no. So yeah, it was ground. It was weak to ground, and it was weak to fighting, which was like. No what? no no. The water. I think water resists no, ground. No, so it, it water does more damage to ground, but it doesn't take less damage from ground. It still takes full damage. So, it? I know it's lightning. Or no, it was I rock. Know I know it's rock. lightning. The water, water to rock. Yeah. No, no, there, there was no circle for it. What's a normal type weakness? Fighting. Fighting. And technically goes, but I mean they just don't do damage to each other. Yeah. God, I remember back then. No, I know. The I know. They don't match do, up they're all I know they don't do it whack. now, but when you fought a ghost type, you had to have had a dark type. Or you could not do any damage. But now it's like you can just hit it whenever you want. It's like, oh god, that sucks, man. I like the difficulty. Cause I would always go out and get a a ghastly, then a haunter. Look, then I'll try if someone you think to think that um Game Freak actually tries to balance their game, you're slowly mistaken. <laughs> and then yeah. and then but like my, fa my one of my first Pokemon I always like to get is a Gengar on my team. I had a Gengar on my team during Shield. I had my sister trade me because you need to trade to get a Gengar. Gengar is like one of the better Pokemon too because high special defense as Bro, well. Bro, I wish his shiny wasn't. No, no, Gengar is a good sleeper. High yeah. speed and high special attack. I, I wish. um with, with a good move diversity. I wish Gengar's shiny wasn't a darker shade of purple. I wish it was actually the white that you would get in a shiny Mega Evolved Gengar. Yeah. But they did really good on this game. This game was really good. Yeah, they did a good job with uh, a lot of stuff. It's just like the fact that, you know, people weren't happy with the fact that they removed so many Pokemon from it made it a lot of people not want to play. Okay, are we you know, going to you know the size of the game well need to play and things they didn't do that well, I think. Okay, so are we going with the bunny? Like, I don't, I don't think there was. they really had a good reason to remove Pokemon. And I could definitely give them a lot of credit for animations, but I also know that the. The player's animations seems like she's almost dead inside. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so quick question. We're still waiting for that Pokemon. We're still waiting for that Pokemon where I can't. Oh, who are we starting talks. with? Yeah, that's what I was gonna ask. Who are we gonna start with? Um You done the, have you done the bunny before? What? What, what, what was your starter before? Score bunny. So you did the bunny? Yep. I did the monkey. Let's do the water guy. Something okay. Even though it's the ugliest one, 
We're going well, this. he turns into a pretty sexy looking. The water one again. is the. I whoa, think the whoa, chill. He turned into like a skinny thing. He turned into a gecko. He turned into a secret agent. Dude, yeah. he got the sniper tower. Yeah. <laughs> sniper tower. <laughs> he's a sniper and he's a sniper on the tower, dude. What I feel bad about this game is I know I know um we would get him. He would get the monkey. No, or does he get the bunny? He gets, he gets the one you're weak to. I know, but in this game, no one gets the third one. Yeah. Except the except the the, the champion. The champion. I know, but in the old games, it'd be like someone else, and you just follow you around and stuff. But usually the. Yeah. So we're going um, with usually Sobble. the, the rival Sobble, goes yeah. to take the one that beats you. Yeah. Usually, but can this we game name him Sob? But Hop is just such a. Hop okay, wait, is wait, just we gotta so come nice. up with a nickname. Twig. Oh, <laughs> we're calling him Twig. Yes, Twig. Wait, should we call him Twitch what? instead? 007. 007. He turned into a secret agent, right? 007. Yeah, he looks. He looks like uh, James Bond. 007. No, no. Go. Come on. Go. Go. Thirteen is the sniper. Can we call him Hero One Hundred Eight? You guys remember that show? No. I what? don't. Oh. What's Hero 108? It's like, it used to be a, a old, it used to be a cartoon show back in the day. And it's like, there's a bunch of like, heroes running around. It's so funny. I, I don't remember. Oh, I'm sorry. So, uh. I don't know. I, I, my vote's Go Go 13. I right, do Go Go 13. I'm fine with Go Go 13. Why is it not wait, capitalized? Wait, wait, we, we gotta, we gotta do it like weirdly. Go X2 13. <laughs> Go, okay, wait, X2, 13? Yeah. Because it'd be times two. Okay, <laughs> wait, wait, I gotta make it even better. Wait, uh, X. <laughs> no space? Do you want no a space, space. or not? Nah, no nah, space. Nah, nah. <laughs> wait, wait, is it 213 or just 13? Go, go. It's go X213. Oh, okay. <laughs> but it's go Pronounce X213 go, go, right now. Hey, that's fine by me. Let's go. Pronounce go go 13. <laughs> I don't even know how long it's been already. It's all good. All right. After we do this first uh, Pokemon battle, we'll we'll end the first episode. I know he does. He doesn't choose the monkey. He chose uh, Score Bunny. He chose the one we were weakest. Uh, he was weakest. Too. Yeah, so I was saying. You're saying the monkey. Yeah, you know? he chooses no, the other whoever one. beat whoever you beat in this game. That's stupid. They should add a challenge. Give us the one. They yeah, because he's a total pushover. No, because this is no type advantage until end game. I love how that bag he's wearing has a handle. He's all like, congratula- wow. That <laughs> monkey was like, who the hell am I going wow, with? Wow, you know type advantages? Right? He, they, yeah, they learned it later in the game. It, it was pretty impressive. I still wonder where this got, where Leon decided, hey, let me just start with the cape. Let me just put on the cape now. He did that to put all the promotion stuff. Look, there's Game Freak. Game Freak's on his cape. Wow. They're the bottom right one. Hmm. Yeah, he's well, sponsored by I, Game I think Freak. it's supposed to be like a pro wrestler. Like when they get, they got the belt, a lot of times they might have to cape, they'll wear like a cape too or whatever to show off or something. But that, that's, that's my picture, I don't actually know. I love how- Damn, like, this kid's fat. <laughs> Look at him, he just grabbed two shish kebabs, like three No, yeah, No, here's my point, like you see everyone's like there, they're moving a bit, you got stuff, and, and meanwhile, play, um, Hop. We got him um, just kind of standing there like a statue. <laughs> like a statue, yeah. Looking at everyone. Cause I I don't I don't need any emotions. Emotions are unneeded to fight. I don't like their eyes. Look at Leo's eye, Leon's eyes. He's a cat. And Hop. I just I just still love how his name is Hop. I feel like they meant to put hope, but just forgot the E. But he loses his hope at one point. I'm about to break this man's leg and make him hop all the way to the finals. I don't know, maybe it's hop. Uh, I mean, it would be in Japanese, so it would be what if it, what if it? What if it's just a... What if, it's, like what if it's just a sound effect? It would be <laughs> hop hoop. Hoop, yeah. Hoop, alley, hoop, away. I remember that. It, it would probably be hop hoop. Nah, we're gonna make him a sound effect. 
I have every Pokemon movie besides one. I don't have Mewtwo Returns. Oh, Is we have first it's one? not Mewtwo Returns. That's the only one I, I don't we have. We have, yeah, Pokemon, I have them the first two. Yeah, you know, just because you asked, no, I'm not willing. I have all the movies, and I just don't have Mewtwo Returns. Can I just I'm, leave? Wasn't it Mewtwo Returns? I No, they're not I, gonna let me. <laughs> What'd you say? Pokemon 1999? Yeah, I have I have it. Yeah. And then there's Pokemon 2000, the power of one, and those are the two I have. I'm not gonna lie, a lot of people might hate me for saying this, but um, you know the one where Pikachu talks? Oh no. Oh, there's Go. one there's a, there's a movie where Pikachu talks. But the end he talks. It says I love you. But it's basically Ash gets his Pikachu in the movie, gets Pikachu, and then he goes on an adventure, and you know Brock and Misty? He doesn't meet them, and he meets a whole new squad. Oh, I don't know that one. I was like, I kind of like this whole new squad better than the old squad. Nah, I miss you best. Need more was that, was that just ba supposed to be based vaguely on the manga? I don't remember. I have the movies. You won't open that window. Or that, not window, that closet. They're all just stacked there. It's called... Oh, man, he's so... Look, look. Look, you got you got Hoop so um, like hyped I got while, hyped while stuff. Um, he's just kind of standing there. <laughs> Let me go through these movies real quick. Let's see. It's called. Um, I should be standing far away right now. I don't care. I choose you, Pokemon. I choose you. It's Pokemon. I choose you. Is the squad on here? No, the squad's not on here. Oh. Well, leave, leave it out. We may watch it on stream one day. <laughs> All right, let's get this Pokemon battle on the show. Yeah, he has two Pokemon. What are you gonna say? Oh, yeah, I don't know why. Oh, All right, he has that. I find it kind of unfair. Go, go! Oh my God, we're we're idiots. If we called it Go Thirteen, it'd be Go Go Thirteen when they it sent out. Go Go Gadget. All right, we gotta start the game over again, guys. Can't oh. <laughs> run through. <laughs> Uh, How did with we not pound. see this coming? Come on, get him! Come on, Bonnie, you can get him. Uh. Oh, we left off at the fourth generation, right? So fifth gen, favorite Pokemon. Um. What was the name of it? Oh, I forgot the name of it. You, you, you just tell us the fifth, fifth gen for now. Okay. I can't remember most of Pokemon fifth gen, it's and it's, like which is weird because they like forced us to use them. <laughs> yeah. Well, what? yeah, it was a whole new generation. They didn't add a single old Pokemon. No, no, no. So in games. other games, you can like still catch Zubats, but specifically in that one, you could not find we lost any you. Pokemon from other gens until you beat the game. Yo, can I just say N? Can I just choose N? Because N was such a great character. I, I like uh, Tepic's third evolution. Um, in that one, my favorite one was actually uh, Sock. Ooh, Sock? Sock is the blue fighting type Pokemon that they added to it. Oh, right. Those guys. Yeah, I fell in love with them. so busted. Like, you just... You uh, train him oh, in specifically Oh, Archipelagos. That... Or whatever it was the um, that the the flying um, fossil. Oh, that, that we talking about that? the dinosaur one? Oh yeah, the weird the, the one weird no, the one that looked one. the one that yeah the one that looked like it was from um, Ink and Myth or something. Oh, I know. That, yeah, um, I, I like that one. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I know it had like one of the worst abilities in the game, but it <laughs> still had really good. Good shots, and I think should have done better and not meta than it did. Eh, it is what it is. Don't ask me about Gen 6. But it Pokemon. was also. A... I, ain't gonna, I'm, I ain't gonna say I like anything from Gen 6. Really? Yeah, I'm not a big. I didn't like Gen Carbink 6. Is, I only know one Pokemon Gen 6. I know I know Carbink. You don't remember oh, Malta to oh, it was Toxic. I don't like anything from Gen 6. But I love. Um, shoot, what was the ultimate Pokemon from that? The Z Pokemon? The Cell one? Oh, you mean the, the the legendary one? Yeah, the legendary. The yeah. green and black one? Yeah, I can't remember the name right now. Uh, I don't remember. Zygarde. I think everyone knows. Zygarde, thank you. 
His final form is the best though. It was so awesome. But I, man. but in my opinion, I'm not gonna lie. I think Pokemon X and Y's TV show was the best one. It was because it 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 it, it I've was heard more good of an anime. About it. I've been watching it though. Because it, it you know how Pokemon caters to children, so it's more of a cartoon at this point than an anime. It's in X and Y. They made it more of an anime than ever. Giant OP fights at the end. Ash finally kisses the girl. Yeah, he does. He gets a kiss <laughs> from the girl. On the lips, brother. At 10. Wow. <laughs> Just because it's not chosen. Yeah, he's still 10. They couldn't show the... Yeah, he's still 10. <laughs> still 10 years old. He he made, he made went through seven regions. And he's no, still he went 10. Through, he went through six, about six regions in one year, and he's still 10. <laughs> You know, you know the funniest thing about it is if you actually go ahead and you count up all the days of Pokemon, it'd equal over a year. The whole like, the Hawaiian sh the Hawaiian um, show was such a bad show. I it, they gave him a mustache. They gave Ash a mustache. I was like what? Yeah, Gen and he's all chubby and fat now. It's like why? Gen Seven was bad. Um, the Galar region is right after that generation two, which is. Like, what is this? Gen, are we on Gen 8 right now? Yeah, this is Gen 8. I don't think they should have done it that way. Because he won the... He became the champion of Galar. Uh, not Galar. Of, um... The Hawaiian one. Yeah. He, yeah, he became... That's, that's the dumbest one. He became yeah, champion. but that doesn't count. There was no Pokemon League. He became the champion in the dumbest series ever. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Alola. Like, Alola. Alola, yeah. And it was just like, why? Like, if you're gonna get rid of it, get rid of it properly. So what they did in the, the <laughs> new series is they're kind of going away from Ash and they're introducing a new I, main character kind of thing. I think it was Gen 4 Pokemon show. You remember they didn't want Ash to win so bad? They threw this. They threw two legendaries at this man. Yeah, that's <laughs> so great. Oh god, this yeah. This man pulled Freaking out a lot of your shit in, in a dark rise. Like, he just threw two <laughs> legendaries at him. He got the play. He played against the act. He played against, he against the, the actual player character. character. <laughs> he played against me. <laughs> so great. It was that was bull. That was tough for him. They threw two legendaries at him, so he wouldn't become champion. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna call it here for the first episode. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and um, let us know what you think. If you like the channel, if you like the episode so far, so give us a like uh, and leave us a comment down below on anything else you'd like to see. Thank you very much for joining us today. And you guys have anything you want to say before we end it here? Uh, yeah. Uh, did you say leave a like and subscribe? Oh, yes, you did. All right. Uh, if you want to tell us what your favorite Pokemon in the comment, doesn't matter what um what generation it is, we'll we want to see it. We said our favorite Pokemon, now I want to hear yours. Rocket, anything from anything you? Anything to say about these people? And I will and I will just die on that mound. You're gonna die. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, peace I out. I defending that. <laughs>